Oh, speaking of which, hey, welcome to the next episode! <laughs> I am not in charge of the weather. Uh, so, we just fucking... We, we, we've we waited a few hours before recording, we recorded some other stuff, so now I've got... Oh wait, I can talk to Leon, unless she's gonna be useless. Or, for once, I can't fucking figure out how to talk to her. <laughs> Turn around. There we go. Oh, that's right. He just like won the semifinals, and oh, so and we're checking on him to make sure fucking because yeah, if the freaking hooligans do something, they're doing it today. Yeah. Ah, uh, let's go save Belku. Oh wait, I need my fucking clipboard. Strap that I. I have a clipboard for this game only because this game has a lot of characters. All right. Yeah, and I don't. I mean, in uh, in Eternal Sonata, we kind of voice stuff, but like not. But there's as... like nine characters in yeah. Eternal Sonata, as opposed to 128. <laughs> Holy shit, is that the actual number? Yes. Oh wow, that's a lot of characters. That's why I'm like some of them. I'm like these. This character will almost never come back again. So I don't need to write down their name and fucking like Marina. Speaking of which, what's the matter, everybody? Oh, it's just terrible. Marina. Marina! Con! Wait, no. <laughs> what? What happened? Uh, what the fuck? Uh, Marina has been... Kidnapped. Ah! Yeah, still going. <laughs> she what? I sent her on an errand, and she never came back. And then, and then... Thousands of live people... No, I'm kidding. Just a little while ago, somebody pushed a lair under that door. It said that if we wanted her back, I should go alone to the hut in the western woods. Looks like Viva too late. It must be the work of those thugs, huh? We don't have any proof, but chances are, yeah. <laughs> those dirty cowards too afraid to go after Belku directly, so they targeted poor Marina. I'm so very sorry. This oh, this is all my fault. What? What? How is it his fault? Because he came. Oh, sorry. Put a sock in it. Put a sock in it. It isn't your fault. The only one to blame are those thugs for kidnapping poor and it's a Marie. I know yeah. it's like I. There are a lot of care. I I feel like I have something similar. It's it's a it's a guilt complex where like you make things your fault even if they aren't. Stop being guilty, Belcoot. But I can't. Look, we don't have time to point fingers. I. I guess you're right. Uh... No question. This is definitely a crime. Not even the patrol guards can ignore this one. I don't think that's a good idea. We wanna keep things as quiet as possible so the hugs don't catch on. Man, my accent's spot on today. It is. I'm very impressed, actually. Thank you. Calling in the patrol guards might put Maria in even more danger. In that case, it's up to me. It's up to da, 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 da. I'll just do what they asked me to do. No, they really might kill you this time. They can try. <laughs> that doesn't matter. Marina's life is what's important. Technically, if it's a cabin in the woods outside of town, that's yeah, out. No one's gonna know that he fucking eviscerated all of that. Exactly. I'm like, that's not in the jurisdiction of anything. Yeah. That's. <laughs> that's the best way to go about it. Even if you do what they say, there's no guarantees they'll let Marina go. Do you really think such low-down, dirty scoundrels would have enough integrity to keep a promise? Then, what are we supposed to do? I just remembered something. I left the kettle on. Bye. <laughs> they said, hut in the western woods. Do you think they're talking about that hut the woodcutters used to use? I bet it's the same fucking hut we chased the, um, arms people to. Oh, yeah. Also, like... I feel like, I feel like it's not important that she's like, wait, what if it's this hut? Like, that's where we'd go to meet them anyways, so like, realizing what hut it is, this is yeah, a Yeah, I know, we know game what game. fucking hut it is, because they yeah. gave us directions. Yeah. It's empty now, so it's a perfect place for no good types like that to gather. Because yeah, no good types never gather case, in a full place. Right. In that case, I have a plan. You do? Yes, there's more than one path to that. Well, hut. yes, it's a hut in the middle of the woods. Yeah. There's an animal trail through those woods, too, and it leads to the back of the hut. If we go that way, maybe we can sneak up on them. Shouldn't a hut be in, like, a clearing, especially if it's, like, you know, a woodcutter's hut? Exactly. They, they, you know, no, they, they drive around. very far away to get their lumber. Yeah. Even we didn't know that. 
Or you could just go through the woods. I used to come visit a lot back when I was engaged to Gazelle. No, we won't read too much into that. <laughs> Please show me where the dot trail is. I'll go on from there alone. George is about to be like, shut up. Oh. Would you quit with that stupid idea already? They've got a hostage. Even if you could sneak up on some, you couldn't do much by yourself. We want to rescue Marina too. Please let us help you. Everyone. I wonder if the Thank Queen's you very Knights much. are permitted to compete in the Sacred Games. Queen's Knights? Um. Probably not. So I'm wondering. I'm like, uh, George is totally like, look, I know you're going into the finals and everything, but don't get smart. Right? <laughs> Come on now, cut that out. Now that it's settled, let's get going. R right. Please, Prince. That girl is just like a daughter to us. Please, we're begging you. Please, that, that's our safe. fucking goal. Yes. Leave it to us, I guess. Oh, hearing you say that, I feel like just maybe everything just might turn out all right. Don't you have like clients? <laughs> thank, you, oh, thank you, all of you. Boku joined. He's probably OP as shit. Hold on a sec. Darn it! He's been drinking like this every day since the game started. I wonder if the other dialogue is different. It must have been really hit him really hard when they rejected his application to take part. <coughs> Cause that was gonna win. I mean, there's no way he can lose, right? Oh, uh, that's right. You did a manly voice for that woman last time too. <laughs> I am consistent on accident. Let's have a toast to Gazelle and victory and stuff. <laughs> okay, creative. Hey, where that woman's usually here? That's weird. <laughs> that childish guy. He's a purebred psychopath, but you didn't hear that from me. Who's, who's Childrich again? Um, Gazelle's champion. Have we had to voice him yet? Because his name isn't on here. Nope. Okay. Although, if we have to, his, his voice is... Oh, yeah. Yeah. Remind me when we get to that point, because I'm sure I'm going to have to voice him at some point. Where's my drink? I feel my bed freezing right now. Where is it? Alright, bye. That's I'm tired done. of talking to peasants. Alright, uh, so I have to figure out how to get out of town. Wait, do I have to go through the castle and out the front gate? It's a good question. Is there only... Is there an actual map I can... Hold on. This button? I don't believe so. Uh, I was gonna say, then we could see, because if this is a fortress... Oh, probably damn, I was right. Go back. Here? No, to the menu. Oh. Hold on. What level's Belcoot? Oh, 19. Damn, George can put him in his place. Good yeah. job, George. Yeah, George can still... He's the fucking Queen's Knight. Uh, or what what does Leon say? Knights. What? What does Leon say? What does Leon say? Oh, fuck! No, I was trying to turn around to talk to her. Ah! Uh. <laughs> Hold on. In the western woods, we're God damn it. Go Maybe if we just head west? Yeah, is there a way out of town in that direction? Because there is that Maybe. little extra bit to the city over there. And yeah, the, we didn't. Did we fully explore it? I'm not sure. We Maybe they stopped us from leaving the city. There is definitely a river there. Yeah, I'm thinking that this island this is probably like an artificial island or an island, and there's only like one way off of it. Yeah, I'm just not sure where that way is. Yeah, probably... We got on from the dock, though. So that means that we don't leave through the castle. Also, that'd be a shitty way to set up a defensive island. It's Ooh, like, yeah. hey, all of our leadership right by the entrance. There you go. <laughs> So this is probably where it connects to the mainland, and that's the fortress bit. Which means that somewhere around- Actually, no, it was through here, because we saw the dwarf over here, remember? Oh, not here, but fucking somewhere. Oh. Yeah, the dwarf was up there. I do feel like it's somewhere over here, I just don't know where in this area. Uh, doot, doot, doot. Not here. 
Let me out! Right? Let me and Kyle out! I'm begging for help. I'm screaming for help. Please just let me out. Rick and Morty reference. Woo. You still need to watch Rick and Morty. I do. I am told that by people who know things. I'm one of them. I know some things. Not like lots of things, but I know some things. Wait. Uh, Prince Fred, it's too dangerous to leave town. What? Say it's an emergency? But you can't say what it's about? Wait, did he say it's forbidden to leave town? He says too dangerous to leave town. Oh, okay. Oh, well, I guess I can let you through since it's an emergency and you are kind of the prince. Yeah. But probably be very, very... If anything happened to you, it'd be my responsibility. Alright, that... I thought he said for a sec that it was forbidden that we leave town. I'm like, do you know who the fuck I am? <laughs> who the fuck are you, Kyle? I'm the fucking prince, bitch. Gatorade me. <laughs> okay. What fuck? Uh, scrub lord over here. We gotta keep this episode going a little longer, because, like, a little plot happened, but... Actually, no, we'll, we will end the episode here. You know, you get to look forward to us going into the woods. I'm looking so of, forward to it. Having lots of shenanigans. We'll see you guys in the next episode.